So I have missing playlists in my created playlist, um, music playlists. I have several genres of playlists and one with a similar name. But this one that I've had for years and I love has just continually over the years gone MIA. And when I get a new phone or a new phone number, it comes back for just a little while, maybe, I don't know, anywhere between a month to a few months. And then it disappears again. So I was wondering if anybody else has this problem. I was on YouTube looking for it, trying to figure out how to get it to show again and couldn't do it no matter what. So naturally, while I was on YouTube, I um, searched, you know, missing playlists and there wasn't anything on there. So maybe YouTube just takes those videos down also. I don't really know. Um, so I figured, okay, if YouTube won't tell me, I'll ask Google. So I Googled it and I came up on this um, site, YouTube Music Help. And there's a lot of people have this issue. So <clears throat> this one guy, he's like um, saying that he has about 100 playlists and most of them are public. Uh, he's missing... I don't know how many, I'm not really sure. But anyway, I only have one that goes MIA. And uh, it's extremely frustrating to me. <clears throat> so I posted on there hoping to get some kind of um, response from somebody. But it seems like uh, nobody has any um, answers or solutions. They did suggest try this or try that, you know, uh, try going on your uh, PC account and uh, renaming it or, um, you know, playing around with it from there, trying to get it to show. I've done all that stuff. Anything that you can do to affect it, it affects it for a, a, just for the moment or for a day or two and then it's right back to doing what it does but I've noticed it's every time I get a new phone or a new phone number the list comes back for a little while so that's kind of curious but you know I run down um, a bunch of questions because it, it doesn't it's got it well people think it's a glitch or something with the YouTube I'm not sure if it's a deliberate uh, attack or if it's a glitch on YouTube's part or if it's something to do with the Google Plus shutdown complicating matters. So anyway, I'm not a very good reader, but I'll just go through like what I what I um, posted here. I said I have the same problem. It's so frustrating. I've tried all of the above suggestions many times over the years, but Randomly, they either don't work or work for a day or two. It's my favorite, longest, little over a hundred out of a dozen multi-genre list play, music playlist, a private collection. Um, had it, had had used it all the time for years. When I get a new phone or a new phone number, it comes back for a little while and then disappears again indefinitely. I'm just going to try creating the playlist over in a few different named lists, see what happens then. Because of this very issue, I started keeping everything in that playlist written down in a notebook so I can go through the long hassle of replacing everything I've lost again and again. Is this only an issue with music playlists? Are YouTube music subscribed accounts also affected? I was considering subscribing to rectify the continual problem. Could it be longer playlists are the target? 
YouTube wants people to buy their music subscription. The account of the missing playlists has more than one playlist with similar names, example, best stuff, my best stuff. Seemingly duplicate lists get removed. Unbeknownst to the account holder, one of the songs in their playlist was illegally uploaded by the source and is flagged for copyright violation by YouTube, glitching the whole list visibility. A certain song was uploaded to YouTube via a Google Plus account by the source and is now being hung up in the Google shutdown, Google Plus shutdown. Only private lists are affected. I set it to private, hoping that YouTube would stop messing with it, but it didn't work. So I want to post this because I didn't find any other YouTube videos addressing the matter. And I want to see if this video goes MIA. That'll give me a clue whether YouTube is covering something or not. And um, maybe somebody out there has an answer. So I don't have expectations that this is going to help anybody other than to let them know that they're not alone. Um, and you can go to this forum if you type the, the title up here at the top, um, YouTube Music Help. And this, this, um, uh, I'll put the link down below, but th that way this, maybe this uh, forum will help you um, at least keep posted or something. But anyway, comment if uh, you find something or know something or have questions that you want to add to the list. <laughs> And maybe we'll get um, enough people to be curious about this that we can get some some answers. There was uh, somebody that said that uh, they have contacted YouTube about it, but hadn't ha had any further response from them. So it's kind of like a one-way thing. You know, you're reaching out to them, but they're not really interested in doing anything about it. And that makes me start wondering... Well, if YouTube isn't active, it's either got so many supporters that it doesn't have to care, which is probably the reason, or it knows that it's going to fall into the cracks pretty soon on account of the Google Plus issues and really feels like what's the point of expending ourselves for something that we aren't going to have anymore. I don't know. Uh, I'm also curious about what's going on with um, the, the Google Plus shutdown and its effect on YouTube. So if anybody has updates, uh, I don't mind if you post some links there for videos that have information on it. And don't put any uh, self-promoting, you know, stuff on there, just relative to the questions posted here type things otherwise I'll delete it uh, but let me know it'd be great to see um, what comes back out of all the millions of people that um, might have this problem and um, I don't usually ever ask for likes or anything but because of this particular issue being so frustrating it would be good to you know, hit a like or a dislike if you don't like it, but just give me something back so that I can kind of keep track of like how many people are actually um, reading this. And uh, I want to see like, you know, um, how many people is this affecting or not affecting. So that's it. Long enough video. And... Look for the link to this forum down below. Thanks.
Anyway, I hope you like my screen reader if the thing shows up. It's a great one. I'll put a link to that too.